it's a long running strand in Western culture that when the centralized thing is ossified and it is unresponsive, you break the glass and you decentralize. That's what Martin Luther did when he pinned the you know, uh, 95 theses to the door of the church in 1517. He was saying the Catholic church become ossified. Actually, faith through comes just through the Bible. And this was, you know, when you think of it as a theological thing, but it was also a political thing where he was decentralizing power away from the church to individuals. And, you know, of course, began a whole conflict over who has, the, you know, authority or what have you. But that is what crypto is doing, is it's decentralizing that power, that verification, who has the authority to say what's true, away from the government, away from the Federal Reserve, and now I would argue away from academia and to the individual with their computer or their mobile phone who can run the calculations for themselves.